What is up, YouTube? Back at it with a new video. Today's my first day of fasted cardio. 30 minutes. I just woke up. It's 6 in the morning. The sun's out. But I'm not looking forward to this. You know, I'm hungry, but I can't eat. You know, when you fast, you can't eat. And I have to go do 30 minutes of cardio on the Stairmaster, so I'm not looking forward to that. But uh, there's that, and I have other news to tell you guys. It's about uh, missed opportunities and how they can, you know, they can suck, honestly. So this week wasn't a very good week for me. I'm going to be honest with you guys. Very bad week. So get this. I had a job interview for a supplement company, right? And if you guys know me, I love supplements and... It was like my dream job. I got interviewed for a really, really big supplement company. And so I had the interview online. They, you know, the video chat interview. And I, I thought I did good, you know. The lady was laughing. I was laughing. I was cracking jokes. She was cracking jokes. Everything seemed, you know, well, right? I thought, you know, I'm, I have this job. I got it, right? I felt very confident, you know. And then, um, so a couple of days later, I get an email from them again. And they're like, oh, thank you for interviewing with us. But when, once I saw the but, game over. I knew I didn't get hired. But we found a different candidate with higher higher uh, expertise or something like that for this position. And I'm like, oh, are you serious? So I was pretty mad. Because, you know, I, I really want that job. But get this. Get this. Just yesterday, I went on their website to see if like they took down the posting it's still there so I have a feeling they lied to me and then they didn't hire anyone else they just didn't want me and that's very discouraging they lied to me like that but you know you win some you lose some but uh maybe I didn't prepare hard enough or well enough but oh well you move on you know next next job and my second opportunity I missed out today was, no, actually yesterday, um, there was this apartment for rent in Sacramento, because, you know, I'm going to go school over there, and um, they post about, they posted it about it on, on Wednesday, so I called, so I called the same day that it was posted on Wednesday, right? I told them, hey, do you guys still have this apartment for rent? They're like, yeah, we just posted it a few hours ago. I was like, I want an appointment. I want to go look at it. And I was like, wouldn't your soon as I can go walk, look at it, right? And they said, tomorrow, which was yesterday. So I, I, I got really excited because get this. If any of you guys live in Sacramento, you guys know how expensive it is to live over there. One apartment, one bedroom, one bath will cost you anywhere from 1000 and up. And I'm not joking. But get this, the apartment I saw yesterday, 8.30. 8.30, right? And you can't beat that. 8.30? Shh, ridiculous. And get this, the apartment has a gym right next door. Literally, right next door. Literally, you just walk over and there's the gym. And I'm like, ah, oh, this is perfect. And it was huge. The gym was huge. So I go look at it, right? I go look at the apartment. I'm like, oh, okay, this is nice. I want it, right? And they're like, oh, sorry, someone applied for it already. We can't give it to you. And I'm like, what? But I have an appointment. What do you mean? Oh, yeah, they applied at 4 in the morning. 4 in the morning? I was like, come on, just my luck. And I should have applied once I saw it. I didn't, I, I should have gone, gone with my gut feeling and just applied for it. But I didn't. And that's, I, I, that's a big missed opportunity because, you know, school's coming up. And I still haven't found a place that's in my price range. You know, I'm trying to stay under 900, you know, around that 800 mark, but it's hard. And I, I, I feel bummed out because the apartment was A, close to school, like 10 minutes away. B, it had a gym. C, it had a, a good layout. It was nice, spacious, you know, it had everything I needed and it was safe. You know, it had, it was gated community. Everything was perfect about it. I missed out on it and it sucks you know like I'm really like I was like pretty devastated because you know this week 
I lost two big opportunities and I can't do anything about it, you know? It sucks, but that's life for you. But uh, I wanna tell you guys, if you guys see an opportunity, jump on it as fast as you can because you never know when someone else might take it and then you're screwed and you don't have that chance anymore. So if there's a job out there that you want, an apartment you want, or like even a girl you want, you better, you know, move fast. But, you know, you learn you learn from these experiences, so it's nothing to kick yourself about. But I just want to make this quick video, maybe help someone out, you know, someone that was in my situation that pretty bummed out, they, you know, missed out on opportunities. But I just got to the gym. I'm gonna go do my fasted cardio, which I'm not looking forward to. But, you know, the competition, August 24th, Sacramento. If you're a local, go cheer me on. But hey, if you want. Okay, but that's that's a wrap for the video. If you liked it, make sure to like and subscribe. You know, it means a lot. We're almost to 100 subscribers. Let's see if we can get there by the end of the month. But thanks for watching. Until next time, I'll see you guys later. Peace.